Hi guys, welcome back to another Cod More Vlogs video. Today I'm going to be reacting to the Swansea City 2019 20 kits. This season kits are very nice and I would like to know your thoughts on them too. So if you let me know in the comments down below and let's get into the video. The first through the wastelands, through the highways, Let's start with the home kit first. This season, as our sponsor on the front of the shirt, we've got YoBet, another betting company. Last season, we had UKBet.com. And this season, another betting company. I don't think it's very good as a betting company for kids. But, yeah. It's YoBet.com with a circle sponsor. We've also got Joba on the side of the kit again. We've had Joba for the last three years. Joba make all right kits, I wouldn't say they're the best, but I wouldn't say they're amazing. But the home shirt is looking very good. This year we've got the black going down the sides and black on the side of the sleeve. And yeah, it's looking very good. It's just the same as last season. I'll put some pictures on the screen now for you to have a look. And yeah, black around the collar as well and by the buttons. But yeah, it's looking decent. I would rate the home kit a 8 out of 10. It's very nice kit, and yeah, we'll get on to the away kit. The away kit this season, I think, is very eye-catching and colourful. We've got a black and blue striped kit, or blue slash turquoise. I think it's very nice. It's nice faded. It does look like Southampton's kit, I would say, but it's very nice. Blue around the sleeve again, and yeah, I'll put more pictures of that on the screen now. Let me know your thoughts in the comments on the kit. Yeah, and also we've got the Yobet company again. Uh, last season we had a red away kit. That was also nice. No, not last season. In 2017 we had a nice red kit. And last season we had a nice black and orange faded. This season I do like the kit. I think I would buy this kit. And I'm going to rank the away kit a 9 out of 10 because I like it. But let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Now we move on to the goalie kit. Uh, first of all, we've got a pink kit. Uh, I saw Molder wearing this in the photos earlier. It's a nice kit. I do like the goalie kit. There's a pattern on the side, like a camouflage pattern on the side of the sleeves. And yeah, it's very nice. Uh, also, we've got a black and blue patterned kit. There's a blue pattern going down the side, black and blue. It's very nice as well. I like the goalkeeper kits the most out of all the kits. And let me know your thoughts down below. I'll put some pictures on the screen now. And then we got the trainer kits. Uh, it's black, green and white. It's very nice. And also the green vests the players wear. Uh, very nice kits. They are a bit Christmas design, I think. It looks like Christmas design. Green, white and black. A bit of Christmas. Christmas is red as well. But yeah, nice green, white and black kit. And I do like the green training kit. It's very nice. Uh, yeah, so let me know your thoughts down below on them as well. And I am looking forward to seeing these kits on the players. I'll put some like clips and pictures on the screen now. And yeah, if you like, like the kits, let me know down below in the comments. And also we've signed Jack Bidwell on a free contract. He used to play for QPR at Brentford. And I'll put some more facts. I'll just tell you some more facts now. Swansea so City have made their first sign of the transfer window. We have signed Jack Bidwell from QPR and Brentford. He's a left back. He started at Everton as a goalkeeper at the age of 11. He was capped for England for hit from the age of 16, 17, 18, and 19. He had a good he had a good run at Everton. He was in the Europa League against Boston or something, and they did very well in the Europa. Europa League. He was at Brentford, he got them to automatic playoffs and he brought them up from League One to the Championship and then he moved on to QPR as a left back and last season he came down to the Liberty and they lost 3-0 to us. He was playing that game. He was also linked up with Rangale who used to play for Swansea 
and the game when we played the QPR we absolutely dominated them. And we're not going to talk about the away game because we got thrashed there, or trashed there. And yeah, beside Jack Bidwell, he came to Swansea for a three year deal. Steve Cooper wanted young players, I think he's age 24 now. And yeah, he's going to be a decent left back, here at the cover of Martin Olsen. And I don't know if he'll get over Declan John. And yeah, he's a decent sign in. I think he'll have a good season at Swansea, I say we play him. You do decent, and yeah, he looks a decent player. So if you do did enjoy the video, please leave a like, subscribe, turn on the bell notification, and I'll see you in the next video. Come on, the swords.